Hello and welcome back to Everything Gaming and today I'm going to be showing you guys how to get the rarest achievement in Forza Horizon 4 which is called Encore uh, which only 0.10% of players have uh, and in essence it just wants you to complete all the activities in a single playlist, uh, festival playlist series. Now obviously in the festival playlist we have four weeks worth of events um, and on the left, very far left you've got the overall throughout the festival playlist and just to the right of that you've got that week's festival playlist progress now you have to complete every single challenges uh including the actual forzathon and daily forzathon events in order to get 100 percent uh so you have to 100 percent each week in order to 100 percent the overall festival playlist now it's a very simple sort of idea and process behind it uh, but actually achieving it can be fairly difficult for me the worst ones are the playground games because you don't know what sort of team you're going to be put with um, and as well the online racing because it could hold you back a little bit and make things you know a little bit longer uh, of a process which can be very annoying but as you can see here I've just got one event left uh, it's one daily Forzathon event which is just to win a drag strip event which is very very easy uh, and as soon as this is completed you'll see the achievement pop up um, now some people have been saying I think that it's been stuck for them um, I'm not too sure on that it might be the case but if that is then you will have to report it to turn 10 to allow them to fix that uh, it worked fine for me first time but like I said it's a very simple idea behind it completing every single challenge including like I said all the daily Forzathon events uh, to unlock it but actually getting there takes a little bit longer and it might be a bit trickier uh, like i said the ones that hold me back the most are normally the uh playground games uh sort of adventure um and a couple of the online races because like i said it don't you, you're not too sure what team you could be put with but apart from that the rest of it is actually fairly easy it's not too difficult uh, it's just a little bit time consuming but you can complete it you know each week's challenge within a couple of days uh sometimes the speed zones for example might trip a couple of people up um but it's all based on obviously how you, what, what sort of skill level you're at um but if you need any sort of help or you're struggling with anything please do say so in the comments and i will try my best to answer your questions um and help you out as best as i can because obviously that's why i'm here at the end of the day that's what i want to try and do but like i said the idea behind this achievement fairly simple getting there is a completely different story uh, anyway guys i hope this has helped you out if it has i'll be very grateful if you could drop a like and if you're new to the channel to subscribe as well but apart from that all the best guys thank you very much and take care